Hi everyone, so I know I haven't filmed a video in a while. Today I'm filming a try on haul. Um, I have been MIA for the past two weeks because I actually started a job, which is really exciting. I've like talked about my job hunt before, but I got hired in my first full-time position. I am a marketing associate at an agency. And so the past two weeks have literally been like training, onboarding, stressful, getting into the swing of like waking up at 6.30, etc. And like commuting and everything. So when I get home, it's dark out and I've just been like trying to adjust to working. So that's why I haven't filmed, but I am back. I'm here, I'm gonna film. Also, my hair is wet. I just showered, I didn't feel like doing my hair, so apologies, um, but it's just, we're gonna go with it. So, enough talking, let's show you clothes. I have things from Primark, Brandy Melville, LF, Urban, and Windsor. I went to the LF sale twice, so I'll show that stuff and then got some good deals so another thing i just wanted to mention is in the month of january i did not buy any clothes i buy a lot of clothes so i made a little pact with myself for the entire month of january i was not gonna buy any clothes so all of these are from like december end of november and then yesterday february 1st i went shopping <laughs> right as like january ended i went back to the lf sale so some of that is here but the first thing i bought that I haven't even worn yet um, is from Urban and it's this little cropped tank with like stretchy material on straps and this was $18. I have it in white. I got the white in a medium but I actually got this one in a large just so like they run kind of weird and I just like the way it fit better. At Windsor I got a shirt that's like a little bit weird. Um, it's this sparkly reflective tube top. It's like you can see it. Um, I got this for a concert. I was going to an EDM concert, so I got that to wear to it. I got I got three things at Brandy Melville. The first is a black long sleeve that's cut off on the bottom and cropped. It just says Los Angeles on it, and it's literally like the softest material. I love their long sleeves and just all the material they use. The next thing I got is this white cropped sweatshirt and it has a little cheetah right there and then on the back it has a little logo. It just says like Brooklyn Bridge Motorcycle Company, fast like a cheetah, don't really know, um, but it's just really cozy. I love cropped sweatshirts. I wear them all the time. And then I got these jogger sweatpants. I have them in light gray. I think I mentioned in my last haul that I ordered them in dark gray. So this is them, they are just classic joggers. They're high-waisted, really stretchy, really thick and warm, which I like. I didn't have any joggers this color. I went to Primark and I got these pants, mainly for work, but I also just think they're cute. They are houndstooth, a little bit cropped. Um, the bottom is rolled and then down the side they have like a black striping. I just thought they were different. Um, I like how the black striping is on them. Makes them a little bit more fun. <laughs> and then I got this sweater. It was on clearance for $5. It's just like a light rosy pink. It has some like piping down the side. It's pretty warm and thick. And it was literally $5. It's pretty long and oversized. I actually got it in extra small because it was so big and it's still big on me which is weird so now i'm gonna get into the mountain of stuff i got at lf the first if you don't know what lf is it's a boutique but it's a chain and they're like in random places they're in massachusetts florida california i'm not really sure where else but twice a year they have a 70 percent off sale and when it's not the sale i don't shop there because like a tank top is $108. So like that's what we avoid. We go when it's on sale. So the first time I went there, I got these pants that look really similar to the other pants, but they're more like gingham, checkered. They're not houndstooth. Um, these are in a small. They're really stretchy, high-waisted. The bottom just is like that, and they're like full length. I didn't try them on because 
they're actually wet i just did my laundry and they were hanging to dry so they're still wet not gonna try them on and then i got three more pairs of pants these ones are loud they are windbreaker material cargo pants and they have a little zipper at the bottom pockets here pockets there pockets on the back they're stretchy kind they're like mid-rise very loud material as you can hear but those are really cool i've been into the cargo pant trend as you will see with my next two items so yesterday when i went back i got this black pair of cargo pants um they have like pockets here and they also have like stretchy waistband these are more high-waisted they're in a small and then they have like a jogger type bottom they're like kind of a denim material uh karmar denim is the brand so i would say they're kind of like a denim cargo but i really like how they look for like going out i can style these so many ways these ones are also the brand karmar they're in um an eight and these are like a light green beige color and they are just like true cargo material khaki material pockets uh tight bottom high-waisted stretchy like very very stretchy they fit really nice definitely going to be getting a lot of use out of all three of these and then i got the same shirt in two colors i got it in white the first time when i went more of a cream actually but it has like a square squared off neckline it's cropped it is ribbed and it's really really thick and stretchy so it's not see-through actually it's not that stretchy but it's really thick so it's not see-through which is perfect for white when i was there yesterday i saw it in maroon and i had to grab it because i have worn the white one already and i love it this as i was saying like this tank top originally would be 108 dollars it's seek the label i got it in a medium but i got it for 12 which is amazing and this i also got the first time i went it is a cropped long sleeve really soft but thin black top and it has a ruching part in the middle with a tie this is emma and sam i got it in a medium and i've worn this already when i went out one night to a bar this sweater i also got the first time it's a cream mock neck i would say seek the label in a medium and the sleeves are rolled and sewed like that which i like it has like a step bottom uneven but this i literally have worn countless times like i'm obsessed with this sweater it's so soft i've worn it with jeans with different like patterned pants i've worn it to work i've worn it like out to dinner with um the first pants i showed the like checkered ones but i just like cannot get enough of this sweater like i just like it's so thick so warm it's been so cold here in boston and i've worn this like too many times but obsessed this sweater is the same material it's like that ch i think it's called like chenille knit i don't know how you say it but it's like that really soft like newer material that's like everywhere but this one is just a v-neck and it has like really cool detailing on the arm i've never really seen a sweater with that and the softness i just had to their sweaters were 24 dollars in the sale and this is originally 148 got it in a small amazing deal so the last thing i got is a pair of shoes these are reeboks um they're the reebok club classic c85 and i got i want to say i got the kids ones i did i got the kids ones in a kids six and i'm a woman seven and a half so this is what they look like they have green writing here green writing on the back they have the green on the tongue and they look like a similar to an air force one but less chunky i've been seeing these at like a couple places the first place i saw them was pack sun i don't see many people wearing them i still see everybody wearing air force ones but i was getting like sick of mine and how everybody has them so i wanted to try out a new white shoe 
they are just like different and cute and i think in the summer these are gonna get really really big so look out for that last thing i got is a new phone i got the iphone xr and i got this case for it from sonics it's just kind of like a tortoise case with a black outline and i got this in the beginning of the month been loving it but that kind of concludes the haul thanks for sticking through it i hope you guys enjoyed seeing some of the stuff i've bought over like well december and then a little bit yesterday but thank you so much for watching and sticking through my two-week hiatus and if you are new here subscribe to stick around follow me on instagram and i will see you guys in my next video